Hi all and welcome back to Nick Morrell and Nick Morrell Abstracts and tonight we've got a canvas it's 20 inches by 30 and we're just going to try and create a bit of fun. I've already prepped this canvas um, with a 41 opaque Pebo and so I've just poured that with a 50-50 medium and coated the whole canvas. We're just going to try and create a ghost pour, a mirror pour, reflection pour, um, whichever you want to call it. So on the white, we're just going to try and get some, um, it's my method, I do a double swipe uh, and then add other colours. Um, just try and, the first swipe I use with just kitchen roll, uh, quite a tough kitchen roll. And we just wet this down the edge, I'll show you. And that's the first phase, the first swipe. And then with the second wipe, I go on to my little tools, swipe tools, and go for the second swipe. So colors using tonight, as we explained, they've got the 41 PBO, that's the opaque. Um, we've got some burnt umber we'll be using tonight. That's the 29, lots of colors in this one. Um, we've got the iridescent copper, the 355, high velocity. Uh, the 351, metallic silver. The 350, iridescent gold, again. And some 26, some Mars black. All from the PBO high velocity range. And we're going to add some, quite some fun colours into the second swipe. Um, again, we're going to add some reds, which is the reds. And this is the, the Dalo Rowney, quite like this red. And the Dalo Rowney again, the Ultramarine Blue. Okay, I'm just gonna try and add some fun into the second swipe. And we're gonna see how it goes. So first phase, just tidy this away. So something different, the ghost swipes. Um, I posted one up, a black one, with lots of fun colours. So we're just going to go with just a different base colour of the white. But you can try anything you want. Um, I've just, just poured that on and tilled it over to get a nice, even, smooth finish. And that's 50-50. And again, if you don't know, we use obviously 50-50 with the Liquitex Pour Medium. Always use this on a 50-50 mix. Guaranteed never to crack. Um, dries, glossy, great finish. And again, quite thin the paints, a lot thinner with this method as we're swiping, a lot thinner. Now, so I've got some tissues ready cut in different sizes. Just put them over to the side. And again, about halfway. So there and there, just roughly. And so quite a thin mix, this one. I'll just run it off the side first. So not too much paint on these ones. Just add a little bit at a time. So this is going to be the first swipe. Burnt umber. The brown. Fine. We may add some more in a minute, but just get it on. A tiny bit of black, Mars black. Let's get the first ghosting. That's Mars black. Metallic copper. The 
little bit of that. And then some white, the 41. Okay, just had some more thicker white. We're gonna pick that up. A bit more of that. Some more silver. Tiny bit more copper. And this, we're just gonna drag this through both ways just to put a quite a different finish on the first swipe. Tiny bit more black. So just run it off the side. That way you don't get a blob. I say just run it off the sides first. Otherwise you will get a big blob. Set that aside. Okay, now with the tissues, it's quite a tough tissue, this one. Uh, not too thin a tissue. Otherwise, once you wet the edge and drag it, it will just rip. So quite a tough tissue. Just checking they've got enough paint there. Might just add some more silver on the edge. Fine. Now your tissues. So I've cut some small, this sort of half size to swipe. I may do one there, a larger one, and then another one. So with this method, you just squirt along the edge here, about a two inch, just down the bottom. That just helps the weight. And then you lay it just roughly halfway. Let it sink and then drag along. That's fine. And then in again, just roughly halfway. And drag again and then discard that tissue you can only use it sort of for two swipes really uh, but that's the effect we're going to try and get um, so I may do a larger one now the full size again just squirt wet always with a spray bottle and just look into just squirt about the two inches it just weights the bottom down and that way it will drag the paint. That's fine. Again, just halfway, just roughly halfway, trying to pick half the paint up. And then drag. And then lift. Just create more of a ghosting on the edges. And again, about halfway. Lay down. And then pull. And then towards the edge, you can just lift and just fades out towards the bottom. So that way you're going to create a darker, getting lighter, and we're going to add another wave through the middle. So we're just going to try again, some little ones now. 
to then wet the last two inches, roughly, and just lay, and the weight will just help pull that down, and then start lifting, and that way it will go. And the white is going to come through as it dries anyway. And just pull. And start lifting. And there. Just creates a stunning effect. And so just, stop. just have one pull. One pull. And then discard. Again, just wet the bottom edge. And then lay halfway. And you can see it starts sucking the paint up. And then start pulling away and ghost. And then the same again. Lay in and start pulling. And then start pulling up. I'm just gonna have to do another little one on the edge. Both edges actually. To catch again, we're just going to try and catch that edge there. Just lay that in, start pulling, start pulling. That's good, and again, halfway again, there, pull down, and then pull up got a tiny bit here I want to just go over again just on the edge there and start pulling up and that's looking good good effects there what the burnt ombre the copper and the blacks and the silvers coming through make it that quick torch once we're finished it's all starting to sell up there's no oil in this at all no oils at all and now we're going to go on to the second swipe method um don't you see the effect there that's the ghost swipe quite simple now once you move on to your tools always a good idea to have a bit of tissue you need to swipe you need to clean your tool after every little swipe once we add the colors <coughs> 